say what her surprise be? No, it wouldn't be much of a surprise if she did. Sarah's right. The best surprises are always surprises. Maybe Tria learned to fly. Oh. <gasps> well, that big surprise. Hello, kids. Nice Hello. to see Hello. you, Tria. So, what's the big surprise? Oh, Sarah, always to the point. Today, I'm taking you to my favorite place in all the Great Valley, my secret getaway. Oh, no. If it's secret, how do we know about it? Because she's going to tell us. Right? Yes, please tell, tell us. What is it? It's my secret... mud pool. Huh? huh? We're going to a mud hole? All I see is the day in front of us. All I see is the day in front of us. Burning bright with a newborn sun. Burning bright with a newborn Come sun. Come follow me. The hills to climb and valleys to roam. Oh, streams to follow all the way home. To the land before time. I think you kids are just going to love my secret mud pool. What's to love about mud? Oh, this mud is special. You'll understand when you sit in it. We're supposed to sit in the mud? Mm, and just let yourself go. Ah, it might be nice to go and let myself go. Hmm. <sighs> oh, uh, me think, uh, uh... We were... Uh, in the middle of a game, Stop the Seed. And we did agree to finish it, right, Ducky? Uh, mud might be nice. Yup, yup, yup. But I know you cannot finish the game without me, so I will stay. <sighs> What's this? Hmm? I thought you'd be off having fun already. Dad, I don't want to go sit in some mud hole. Tria put a lot of thought into this little trip. If you don't go, I'll never hear the end of it. But, Dad... You're going. <sighs> I'll go. <laughs> <sighs> Come on, Sarah. The sooner we go, the sooner we'll be on our way. And the sooner we can have fun. <sighs> Fun at a mud hole? Right. Here we are. Lovely, isn't it? Being here is even better now that we're here. <laughs> it's just mud. <sighs> me glad we not at mud pool. Me no think mud good for wings. Now! We got it, we got it! Me miss it. Yeah, but I won't. Huh? Look like... Tooth. Like your tooth, Chomper. My tooth? On the ground? But my teeth are supposed to be in my mouth. Me agree, but that tooth definitely not in that mouth. My tooth! My tooth! My tooth! Does it hurt? No. You think it will? I am sure it will all be okay. Okay? Okay! What's next? An arm? A leg? My tail? Not my tail! What's happening to me? Me never hear of Tooth just falling out. Never? Never? Well, I have. 
Huh? And I wouldn't get too attached to that tail if I were you. Hmm. Oh, I am certain Chomper is very attached to his tail. Yup, yup, yup. It's true. I am. It starts with a tooth, and before you know it, a fella's turning to bones and falling to pieces. I don't want to turn to bones. It isn't up to you. Mark my words, by nightfall, you'll be nothing but a pile of bones. Wait! How do I get my tooth back in my mouth? Hmm. We could ask Mr. Thicknose. He's heard about all sorts of things. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You came to the right place, Chopper. I've heard of many ways to stick things together. No reason they wouldn't work on teeth. You think so? Certainly, my boy. Say I and open wide. And I'll take a look inside. With some sticky tree star juice. That old tooth should not come loose. I'll fix your tooth. Flower duck might do the trick. Maybe mud that's nice and thick. You know what? I'm sorry, son. I can't fix this one. Can't fix my tooth? Cannot fix his tooth. Sorry, it's the truth. Too bad it's the truth. He cannot fix your tooth. I am sorry none of my sticky solutions worked. Until today, I've always tried to avoid direct experience with sharp tooth teeth. If only sharp teeth lived here, so I could ask them about teeth. Huh? <gasps> what about Ruby? Ruby? She doesn't have any teeth! But she's lived in the mysterious beyond, where there are lots of sharp teeth. Maybe she has seen this before. You think so? Mm-hmm. Ruby knows many things. She does. She does. Maybe she fixed tooth. But she's not here. And what if she's not back by nightfall? I could fall totally apart by then. Then we'll just have to go find her before that happens. <laughs> um, not that it will happen. But... We do not know where the mud pool is. Say, Chomper good smeller. Maybe he follow Ruby's smell. I'll sure try. What kind of a three horn sits in mud? It's just as silly to sit there and watch, Sarah. Good point. I won't watch anymore. <sighs> we have been going to the secret mud pool a while, but I do not know if we are getting there. Maybe that's why Tria calls secret mud pool secret. We're okay, as long as Chompers got their scent. <laughs> Huh? Uh, this way. Are you sure? Tria go in there? That's what my sniffer says. Then we go in there too. Ooh. This sure strange place for relaxing. I do not think I would be relaxed in here. No, no, no. 
Oh, it's not so bad. Ouch! Something bite, Petrie. Oh boy, a buzzing buzzer! <laughs> I don't think they taste good, Chopper. Yeah! Mmm, spicy. Well, at least you scared the stinging buzzer away. Oh no, here he comes again. having fun. Steaming buzzers not follow us. Then we are safe. Fix it. Not if we can't find her. My sniffer led us into that cave. Oh no! Maybe my nose is going to fall off next. <gasps> hey, why didn't I think of it before? We can use the looking rock. Grandpa says you can see the whole Great Valley from the top. Sometimes me scare me. <laughs> Look, the mud pool, just beyond the murky swamp. That easy to find. Are you finished relaxing yet? Come on, Sarah, try dipping in one toe. 
Fine. It's warm. Mmm, that's what makes it so nice. I didn't say it was nice. It's still dumb. <laughs> this is supposed to make me relax. <laughs> now that you're in, doesn't it feel good? Well, it's better than usual, Mud. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, this place not smell so good. If you lived here, I am sure you would get used to it. Yup, yup, yup. Oh, me not so sure. Right now, it wouldn't be so bad if I lost my nose. Hey! Oh no! Sinking sand! <coughs> Chopper, get out of there or sinking sand will pull you in. I'm trying. <coughs> <coughs> if you have sharp teeth or no teeth. That's right. You'll always be our friend, Chomper, no matter what. But what if Mr. Threehorn's right and I turn to bones? The mud pool's just past those trees. Maybe Ruby knows something. But Chomper does not want you to leave his tooth, even if it is in the sinking sand. Me stay with Chomper. You go find Ruby and others. Thanks, Petrie. We'll be right back with Ruby. Uh, excuse me. Have you seen a fast runner with a spike tail and two three horns? Oh, hi, guys. What are you doing here? Sarah? It is you? Sarah, we have to find Ruby. It's important. Uh, follow me, please. Here we are. Ruby! We have been looking for you all day. Yup, yup, yup. Ah, I'm right here. Of course, I'm always here, since here is wherever I am. Chomper needs your help! Huh? He's not far! Come on! Follow us! Follow us! You guys really need to relax. He's right here! Are you okay, Chomper? No. My tooth is gone. Forever! What? You interrupted our relaxing day for a tooth? A tooth? One day I try to relax. You guys come out here and spoil Now, now. I... We're just glad Chopper's not seriously hurt. Not hurt? I'm falling apart! 
aren't. Have you ever seen a sharp tooth with a missing tooth? Oh, yes. Huh? I've seen it more times than I care to see. <gasps> really? Why, sure, Chomper. You're going to lose all your teeth. All of them? Ah! Normal sharp teeth normally lose their teeth. So if you lost your tooth, you're a normal sharp tooth. I'm normal? Here, give me your claw. Feel that? That's your new tooth. New tooth? Yes, new tooth. And this new tooth will be new until you're old. Really? I feel so happy, I want everyone to see It's like the bright circle is shining inside of me I lost <gasps> my tooth by some mud, and then a tooth, and now they're excited about the mud again. Hey! 